Hello and welcome to the Tenergy channel. In this video, we're going to address some frequently asked questions about the Tenergy TN474 charger. This is a charger with four charging slots for AA and AAA batteries. You can recharge nickel metal hydride or nickel cadmium batteries. It's a great choice for people who are light users and don't use too many batteries at a time. Let's dive a little bit deeper with some of the commonly asked questions. What is the charging rate of the TN474U charger? The charging rate for TN474U charger is 450 milliamps for both AA and AAA batteries. It doesn't matter how many batteries you have inserted, it doesn't change the charging rate. Whether you're charging one battery or filling up all the slots, that 450 milliamp charging speed stays the same. So no matter the quantity, you can expect a uniform charge rate across the board. What type of batteries is a TN474U compatible with? This charger is specifically made for nickel metal hydride and nickel cadmium, AA and AAA batteries. Keep in mind that it's a no-go for lithium-based batteries because they need a different method of charging. So always pick a charger that matches your battery chemistry. What are some ways I can power the TN474U charger? This charger runs on a 5V 1 amp or 5W input and comes with a micro USB port. This means any power source that can provide 5 volts, 1 amp, or 5 watts can be used to run the charger and refuel the batteries. You have options like a standard USB wall adapter, a portable power bank, or even a solar panel. The key is to ensure the power source keeps a steady 5 volts, 1 amp output to get the optimal charging performance. If the source doesn't give enough power, like the required 5 watts in this case, you might spot the screen being a little bit glitchy. Don't worry though, it won't cause any damage to the charger or the batteries. Just keep in mind that the charging will take longer because there's not enough juice coming in. Will using a quick adapter make the charger charge faster? No, it won't speed up the charging process. The charger is designed to accept an input of 5 volts 1 amp and deliver a charge current of 450 milliamps. This means that even if you use a faster adapter like a 5 volt 2 amp, the charger will not ramp up the charging speed. Why does my charger not work anymore? There are a few reasons why your charger might stop working. One reason could be the power supply. Check if the outlet, cable, or adapter you're using is actually working. A bad connection can prevent the charger from getting power. Another possible reason is the batteries. If they're dead, faulty, or not compatible, the charger might not show anything on the screen. Sometimes chargers just wear out. Like any gadget, they have a limited lifespan. If yours is old and well used, it might be time for retirement. Internal parts can also cause troubles. Components like fuses or micro USB port might wear down over time making the charger stop working. If you're unsure about what's going on with your charger, feel free to contact our customer support. And if it's still within the one year warranty, odds are you will be able to get a replacement. Do I have to charge four batteries at once? Nope, you don't have to charge all four batteries together. This charger comes with an independent charging slots for each battery, so you are in control. Charge one AA battery if that's what you need, or toss in a couple of AAAs or AA batteries. It's totally your call to mix and match for whatever you need. How long does it take to charge the batteries? To figure out how long the battery will take to charge, just follow this formula. Use the battery's capacity divided by the charger's charging current, then multiply by 1.2. That's an estimate for this charger's efficiency. This will give you a ballpark charging time. Let's take the Premium Pro AA batteries, which has a 2,800 milliamp hour capacity. This charger's charging speed is 450 milliamp. And using this formula, estimated charge time comes out to be 7.7 hours. Just remember that this is just an estimate. The actual charge time can vary based on the battery's condition and its current charge level. Why do my batteries heat up when charging? It's completely normal if your batteries warm up a bit or feel a tad hot while charging. When you charge a battery, you're pushing energy into it, and that process can produce some heat as a side effect. Kind of like when you feel warm during a workout. However, while some heat is okay, too much heat can be a red flag. If you're overcharging, charging a faulty battery, or charging them in a sauna-like environment, they might get hotter than they should. So, bottom line, feeling a little bit of warmth during charging is okay and expected. But if things get super hot or you catch a whiff of something odd, unplug those batteries and let them cool down. Now, to prevent this heating party from going wild, here's what you can do. First, make sure your batteries are in good shape and compatible with your charger. Second, pick a cool and breezy spot for charging. No heat waves allowed. And lastly, once they're powered up, take them out of the charger and you're good to go. How do I know if the batteries are fully charged? Once your battery is completely charged, you'll see that the battery icon on the screen is filled up with bars. It'll stay solid in the slot where the battery is being charged. This is the green light. Your battery is now fully charged and ready to do its thing. But here's a tip. Once your batteries are all charged up and ready, don't just leave them hanging in there, even if you're planning on using them right away. 
it's a good idea to take them out of the charger. Leaving them plugged in, even when they're fully charged, could lead to overcharging, and we don't want that. It's a small step that can make a big difference in keeping your batteries in top shape for longer. Will the TN474U charger automatically turn off? The short answer is yes. The charger is designed with a cutoff mechanism when specific conditions are met. Now let's get into the more technical answer. First off, if the battery is fully charged, the charger will detect this by monitoring a drop in voltage. This is called negative delta V. This indicates that the battery has reached their peak charge. Once this drop is detected, the charger stops the charging process for that slot. And to clarify, the charger doesn't use trickle charging, it simply stops once the battery is fully charged. If for some reason the negative delta V detection doesn't work, the charger has a built-in timer. This timer ensures that the charging stops after a set period. Also, if you accidentally insert a non-rechargeable battery or a faulty cell, the charger takes action. It will shut off charging for that slot and might either show a blank screen or display an error message. To be cautious, it's a good idea to remove batteries in any of these situations right away. This minimizes any potential risks and keeps things running smoothly. What does the charge error mean? If something goes awry during the charging process, the charger screen will display an error message here and the battery icon will blink in a particular slot where the issue is occurring. Typically, this indicates that the charger has spotted a non-rechargeable alkaline battery or a battery that's faulty or overly discharged. There might be times when the screen remains blank, which could mean that a lithium iron phosphate or lithium ion battery has been inserted. In either case, we recommend removing the battery that's triggering the error. Can I use a TN474U charger to charge other brand batteries? Yes, as long as the batteries are compatible with the charger, which is AA and AAA sized batteries, and if they're either nickel metal hydride or nickel cadmium batteries. However, we recommend using the batteries with the same brand as the charger for the best experience and performance. What combination of TN474U does Tenergy offer? Right now, we have two main options available. The first combination gives you a TN474U charger and a pack of four Centura AA batteries. The second combination is packed with value as well. You'll snag a TN474U charger, plus a four pack of Premium Pro AA batteries and another four pack of Premium Pro AAA batteries. One of the top perks of going for a combination is the saving. You'll spend less compared to buying everything separately. And if you're all about more power for longer device usage, consider the second combo. It packs our Premium Pro battery lineup, which has 2,800 milliamp hour capacity for the AA batteries and 1,100 milliamp hour for the AAA batteries. And that's all for today's video. We hope that with these explanations, we've given you a clear understanding of the Tenergy's TN474U charger. If you still have any other questions, feel free to drop them in the comment section below. If you find this content valuable, a thumbs up and a subscription to our channel would be much appreciated. Thank you for tuning in and until next time.